Hello. Okay, so I finished up at Creativation and, um, you know, we came back home and um, I had the best time, guys. It was so much fun. So I just want to wrap things up by showing you all the things that I got from Creativation um, and just sort of do a quick review of some of my thoughts on the show. It was so much fun. So let's get started. Let's start looking at stuff. And um, I really did feel super special going to the show. I really felt like a princess. Now I'm kind of turned back into a pumpkin, but that's okay. I got lots of fun goodies from my time at the ball, so I'm good with it. Wait, did the pumpkin become a princess? In Am my I... version of the fairy tale, <laughs> pumpkin became a princess. That's Ryan talking, by the way, in the background. Say hi, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. <laughs> so, uh, for, okay, so first, look how freaking cute. You guys can't even see. This bag is humongous. Like, this bag is like the size of me, practically. It's so huge. Um, and uh, they were just giving it away at one of the, what booth did I get this from? My God, I don't even remember at this point, but they, there were lots of different bags being given away at different booths. And uh, this was one of the ones that, that I got. And then I also got this one. This one is probably my favorite. This is the Maggie Holmes one from the Maggie Holmes booth. I love that it's got the like little um, swan on it. It's super pretty. I love it. And I loved meeting um, Maggie Holmes. I got to meet Maggie Holmes and she was super sweet and awesome and that was really cool. So that was fun. They do give you actually bags also. Hold on, let me show you. They also give you bags when you first get there. Like Ryan and I, you know, we went together and um, we each got one of these bags, which they give you when you first walk in, right? So we each got one of those, and in those came like a ton of information, um, different, there was like a map of the whole show. I'll just start pulling out stuff. And some of these things that came in the bag, and then some of the things I added to my bag, like, because people were handing out things, and um, there were lots of just free goodies and stuff. So I'll just show you some of that really quick. So there were Jolly Ranchers. There was tons of candy. A lot of people had candy bowls. Um, this was cool. This was like, they were showing this wire twisting thing from We Are Memory Keepers. And I asked if I could take one of the little hellos that they made. I think it's super cute. Um, I wonder if I can use it. I might be able to use it as a paper clip too. It's really cool. So, and they showed you how to make different kinds of paper clips. Like you can they make said a work. Each one could be. Also Did they a paper see clip? each yeah. one could be a paper clip? I don't remember, but it was really cool. Um, there were some rub-ons from Heidi Swap. This one says "One Day at a Time," and this one says "Life is Good," and the other one says "Heidi Swap" on it. I got a excuse me. I got a ton of, you know, cards, business cards. So I was trying to do some networking while I was there. You know, trying to be cool with my business. I'm so not cool. <laughs> I was a big nerd. I mostly just ran up to people and went, hi! <laughs> I was so excited. You know, and everybody's like, I don't know who you are. And I was like, but I know who you are. Um, so like Amy Tangerine, um, Heidi Swap, Maggie Holmes. I'm just running up to people going, hi! <laughs> they probably thought I was so weird. Um, oh, look, I got some glue dots. That's nice. Let's see. Hero band leather bracelet kind of thing. Tons of like brochure kind of thing, giveaway stuff, all kinds of information. Um, I think like information maybe on other like craft shows and stuff like that. Coupons. I mean, you just get a ton of stuff. I think this might be like a list of the booths, maybe. Show directory addendum. Yeah, that's what that says. Um, just lots of lots of different things um, and that came in the bag when you first go and get it. And then there was also some things that I picked up and stuck in my bag. Like this was a Webster's Pages um, catalog. And you know, Webster's Pages was one of my favorite booths. We went there and we videotaped, which you probably saw already. We videotaped with them and we showed like how cute the Everyday Wishes kit looks in their planners. 
they have some like really amazing um, new uh, planners like ring bound and also Traver Traveler's Notebooks in different sizes. And I super loved those. So I grabbed a, a catalog of that. Um, oh, look, there's the Fairy Tale Club castle card. Um, here's the, if you open this up, this is like the map of everything. Ta -da! So that was the map. And then, yeah, as I said, like I grabbed different catalogs from different places like Sizzix and Tim Holtz. Tim Holtz had this weird like 3D thing going on, which is really cool. And they gave like 3D glasses, although I don't know where my 3D glasses are. And then here's like the big Sizzix catalog. And they had some really cool stuff um, like planners and little traveler's notebook stuff, stuff from Sizzix too, which I was really excited about. So um, that was really cool. Let's see, got a doodle bug catalog, another Tim Holtz one. Um, doodle bug had some really cute pins and they were giving away some free pins, but I didn't get there in time to get some. And I'm just trying to see what else, like as far as catalogs that I got, so I can just show you. I'm not sure what catalog that is. <laughs> Probably just something somebody handed me. And then the We Are one, which like I said, was really cool. They had some really awesome new tools from uh, We Are. Um, I still really want their sewing machine and their typewriter machine. Um, and I do want that like wire twisting, new wire twisting one that they have now. Um, okay, but let's get to the really good stuff, right? We're like, where is the really cool scrap looking stuff, Andrea, right? So let me just pull out, these were our badges, right? Which by the way, they spelled my name wrong. <laughs> That's okay. That's all right. Um, but I'm going to start pulling out the cute scrapbooking stuff. So at the show, right? I met so many amazing people, like tons of really nice people. But I have to say one of the nicest people that I met, so, <laughs> so nice and amazing was Shamel. And I feel bad because I don't think we did any video with Shamel. Like I know we took pictures with her, mm -hmm. but I was just so happy and having so much fun talking with her. I don't think I ever got to, and I meant to like go back and shoot some video, like at least at her booth, cause her booth was set up really super cute too. Um, she had like crayons all around her desk and this cute like rug on the floor. And she had all these cute like cut out frames and stuff you could take pictures with. It was adorable. Um, and she's adorable guys. Like I have to say Shamel is just, I want to be her buddy. Like she's so super duper nice and amazing. Like she was so sweet to me. I had the best time talking to her. Like she's such a really genuinely nice, super just kind person and very genuine and just super sweet. Like exactly what you hope <laughs> that she is when you watch all her cute and what you expect because I've been watching her videos like Glitter Girl and stuff since like way back when Two Peas was like still a thing. She'd do her videos all the time. I remember that guys. I've been scrapbooking for a long time and I think I've watched like all of her videos and I always thought that she was really nice and she legit is like that in person too. Just super sweet. So anyways, she told me that I could take like basically all this stuff. She gave me like all this free stuff because she's just really, really sweet. Like how cool is this? She gave me some of her cute little scissors. These are like from her Glitter Girl collection and they're all glitterified on there and it's such a pretty color too. I love this color. It's like this aqua minty color which I actually have in my bedroom. And um, she gave me like Here's a little Glitter Girl self-inking stamp. I love this because it's got unicorns on it. And here's the Glitter Girl ephemera pack. Look how stinking cute this is. I love it. It's got unicorns in it, so you know I love it. Um, this, I think, is my favorite, as you can tell, probably because they're paper clips, and I'm always super in love with paper clips. And hello, there's unicorn paper clips, and they're pink, and they're glittery. So, I mean, who doesn't love that? That's like the best thing ever. Um, some really cute little like wooden buttons and enamel buttons and sequins. 
Um, I love this collection. This collection is adorable. I love that she did a collection after like her superhero version of herself, the like little girl uh, collection. Love the washi tapes, especially the unicorn one and the stars. Those are awesome. And some really cute, what are these called? Glitter shaker stickers. And they do shake, like you shake them around and they're all like puffy. And they got the glitter spa sparkle stuff that shakes on the inside. Hold oh, I'm sorry. I love those. Love the enamel dots. I mean, she gave me like one of everything from this collection, which is super cool. Um, these are the enamel charms. And I've got to make like a necklace or something out of these or a pin, a brooch or something. These are amazing. I super love this uh, unicorn Tell one. Me. Unicorn. Who doesn't love a unicorn? And it says, may all your dreams come true. Super sweet. I mean, that that is very fa fairy tale clubby, guys. Like, that is super. It's like she's in my mind. <laughs> um, that's the kind of stuff I really like. And so super cute stickers. I'm definitely going to be incorporating this stuff with my stuff. Um, and it just, it's so good. I love these stickers. And we got some little corner guys. And um, some awesome, uh, like, script word thickers, glitter thickers that say things like magic and smile. Awesome. Dream. Hello. I mean, hello. Mm -hmm. Really cute, right? So she gave me all that good stuff. She also gave me some stuff from, so this is like a newer collection, but it's not the newest one that just came out, but it is a new one and I didn't have like any of this stuff. This is from the newest, newest collection, which is called Box of Crayons. And I think obviously that's why she had the desk set up with all the crayons and stuff and it was super cute. And so Box of Crayons too, this new collection is super cute. I love this um, vellum sheet which is all sparkly and then she gave me tons of paper wow look at this paper okay most of this paper is from chamel i did also get some free paper from um pink paisley they were nice enough at pink paisley to give me some paper too which i thought was really awesome so um but let me show you the chamel stuff really quick first so i think okay i think this is chamel here and I think then this start, starts pink paisley. Okay, so, um, all right, so let's see. Some of it is, let me, hold on. So, yeah, some of it is the Glitter Girl collection, and then some of it is the new Box of Crayons collection. And so, some of you, probably a lot of you have already seen the Glitter Girl collection, so I'll just go through this quickly. So these are all from the Glitter Girl collection. So we got these nice numbers, ooh, with the birdies on the back, very cute. I love these dots, very nice, some pink on the back of that. We got some cool uh, geometric going on and some pink on the back of that, some pretty birdies. Again, very cute. There's a stripe on that, there's a stripe here. I'm just trying to go through quickly, guys. Um, this one's awesome, cute little cut apart sheet. Here we've got, oh, unicorns. You know how I love unicorns. I mean, this is just some good, some good stuff, right? This is just really beautiful, pretty paper. Oh, I love the pink, pink ledger. Who doesn't love a pink ledger? And rainbows, of course, are fabulous. Um, okay, and then, this is the box of crayon stuff, which I, as I said, was from the new collection. So the newest one. So we've got this nice stripe with the dots on it and then a cool teal on the back. We've got some fun dots that have like patterns inside them, which is nice. And then this cool geometric on the back. And I love that, you know, stuff like this, like the stripes and stuff and these circles down here, it really does look like it's colored with a crayon, which goes with the whole theme of the collection. Um, we've got a fruity on this. This actually reminds me of something, I think, from Basic Gray, maybe? Like a while back? It's very pretty. Um, and then, you know, like a long time ago. And then um, some orange and pink. And then it also reminds me a little bit of Carmen Randa, like the lady with the tutti frutti hat. Um, and then here we've got some nice framage 
with some nice little sayings like, yep, yes, uh-huh, work and achieve, create, blah, good things take time. And then a nice stripe on the back. Here we've got a beautiful heart. And then some yellow stripes with some, I think those are purple polka dots. Ooh, and I like the little heart strip at the bottom. That's cute. And then we've got some cameras. Sorry, I'm going fast, guys. I'm just I'm trying to show you a lot. Green polka dots. I super love this floral. This is super duper pretty. And the nice blue and teal stripe on the back. And then over here, we've got a really cute cut apart sheet. I'm loving the puppies. The puppies. And we got a little toucan. And we got the cute. Very nice. And she said some of these things were sort of loosely inspired by her Disney face because she's also a big Disney fan, which I super appreciate. And we talked about Disney together. Oh, yeah. We had to talk about Disney. You know we did. Because um, she's a big Disney fan like me. And so the little, like, lizards on here are, are uh, inspired by um, Pascal. Yeah, Pascal from uh, Tangled. And, like, the toucan, I think, is supposed to be inspired by, like, the... Um, like the tiki room in Disneyland. And I, I'm i pretty sure the puppies are supposed to be inspired by Lady and the Tramp, especially here together, these two really do look some Lady and the Tramp action. So then some blue with polka dots, which is funny. And I told her that I was working on some Lady and the Tramp stuff recently too. And she was like, really? I just, I loved her. I love talking to her because we're both like, we have a lot of things in common and she was just super duper sweet. So, and obviously when you find someone who loves Disney like you, you know, that's just, that tugs on the heartstrings like so much. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, guys? You know what I'm saying? So anyways, um, so that was all my Chamel stuff. She was super sweet. She gave me so much stuff. And then um, Pink Paisley, I also got some stuff from them. So this is from, I'm not sure which collection it's from. I think it's one of the newer collections. They had like one collection, I think, that was not brand new. And then uh, the rest of the collections there, I think were like brand new ones that they were just starting to show at the show, you know, at Creativation. So I got these lovely hearts. I love these hearts. Some nice red stripage on the back. Cute little bows, look at that, love that. With the blue cross on the back. And these are mixed guys. These are, I, I don't think these are all from the same uh, collection necessarily so and it's kind of hard to tell what collection each one of this is from because you know if you know pink paisley they always do like numbers on stuff and you so it's kind of hard to tell what collection things go to right you see what i'm saying so anyways here's a cute uh cut apart sheet i love this always believe something incredible is about to happen very cute a nice pink on the back so this one was from uh Page, Page Evans, and I, I'm trying to see if these were too, yeah, these were all Paige Evans, which Paige Evans, I love her stuff, she does really cute stuff, um, beautiful birds, I love these, these are like swallows on here, some nice mint on the back, we got some butterfly action, kind of has a retro vibe to it, which I really appreciate, and a blue stripe on the back, then here we got this is not Paige Evans. This is just straight pink paisley. And we've got a nice cut apart here. I'm loving the, the unicorn. And a beautiful um, cloud sort of photo looking um, image on the back. And then this is also just pink paisley. Not Paige Evans, but pink paisley. It's got some cute stuff here. And some nice hearts on the back. And then there were some doubles. Like that was a double. I'm trying to show you other things. Okay, so here's the stripe. Uh, that's another double. There's some calendar action and some numbers. I'm just trying to go through this fast now, guys, because we don't have a whole lot of time, but just some good stuff that I got from their new, um, from their booth and their new stuff. I was very excited to get some of these really cute uh, things here. Um, just one of the, the ladies at the Pink Paisley booth was like, yeah, take the paper you want, you know, which is so nice of her, so. They're awesome. There's so many nice people. Um, to, or her name was, was Lorley? Was her name Lorley? I don't know. I think her name was Lorley. I'm going to check on that. I know she's um, Rosie Posey on Instagram. And I believe her name was Lorley. And she was super nice. And I'm going to double check on that. 
So, but isn't this super duper cute, all of this stuff? I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Lots of cute stuff, lots of good things. Very, very nice. Okay, so lots of great stuff. And yeah, I'm, I'm pretty positive I, her name is Loralee. <laughs> and she's very, very sweet, very sweet woman. And um, I just met so many nice people at at, a, at Creativation. It was amazing. And I got to meet some of my big inspirational people um, like Chamel, like um, Maggie Holmes, like um, Heidi Spock. Um, who else did I get to meet? Uh, I got to meet Tam Amy Tangerine and Tim Holtz. I mean, some of these people I just met super quickly um, and didn't get to talk to for um, that long. And other people I did get to talk to longer. But all of it was really, all of it was really exciting. All of it made me really happy and um, just made me feel really special, you know, for the day. It was just a one day, really quick trip. Um, we just went for like a few hours, but it was super special. And we didn't even get to see everything because the place is huge. Like it's ginormous. Um, and with my legs and everything, I couldn't see everything. And with the time, but I did get to see a lot. It was super amazing. It really felt like a dream come true. And I'm definitely, definitely gonna try and go next year and actually go for the whole thing and try to like have a booth there and everything. So um, this is just like, baby steps towards things to come you know we're trying to grow the company and uh yeah that that's about it i just i loved it um i think my favorite some of my favorite things were obviously like i loved the the new um chamel stuff i loved the new uh pink paisley stuff i loved there were some really amazing planners from heidi swap there were some really amazing planners from Webster's Pages. Um, there was obviously always really cute stuff from Crate Paper and Maggie Holmes. I'm always a big fan of theirs. Um, Simple Stories has, has some really cute stuff out now too. Um, just there's so many amazing things that are coming out right now. And I'm just so thrilled that I got to be there with all these people getting like first looks at all of this cool new stuff and getting to feel like I was really part of the industry, you know, and I showed, showed my stuff to people, showed my, my everyday wishes kit. I, you know, I talked about the fairy tale club and I kind of showed how on the videos to you guys, how you can mix in your fairy tale club stuff with some of these new cool things that are coming out of uh, creativation. So, um, like the memory board from crate paper or the cute little planners from like Heidi Swap glitter planners. You gotta get those, man. Those will be perfect with your, your kids. So, anyhow, that's about it. Um, check out our other video that we're putting up right now, which is just uh, my sort of uh, unboxing walkthrough of all the Everyday Wishes stuff. And um, thank you so much for joining me in my bedroom. I know I'm a pumpkin again and not like a princess at CHA. But I'm here and I'm going to try and do um, more social media stuff and more um, YouTube videos and stuff even when I am in bed like this and I'm not doing as well because I do want to stay in contact with you guys um, even when things aren't going great for me because as I always say, it's important to tell our stories. It's important to write your own happily ever after. And of course, even when things are tough, it's so important to live your life as a fairy tale. So have a great day, everybody. And... Um, Remember to live your life's fairy tale. Bye.